Hi, welcome back to Fix Your Apps. In this video, we're going to show you how to separate iPhone and iPad with the same Apple ID and keep them working more independently. Now, let's get started. First, open the Settings app on your iPhone or iPad. This is where all your device preferences are stored. Next, tap your Apple ID at the top of the screen. This section controls your account and device connections. Scroll down, and you'll see a list of all devices connected to your Apple ID. Tap on the one you want to change. Now review the apps and services syncing across your devices. You can choose what to keep shared and what to separate. To manage what's synced via iCloud, stay in Settings and tap your Apple ID again. Then tap on iCloud. This is where your data sync preferences are located. Tap on See All and toggle off anything you don't want to sync like photos, messages, or contacts. This stops them from being shared across both devices. Now let's stop automatic downloads. Go back to Settings, then scroll and tap on Apps, and choose the App Store. Find the section called Automatic Downloads, and simply toggle it off. This prevents new apps or content from being downloaded to both devices automatically. If you want complete separation, you can use a different Apple ID for each device. To do this, go to Settings and tap your Apple ID again. Scroll all the way down and tap Sign Out. This removes the current Apple ID from the device. Then, sign in with a new Apple ID or create one for this specific device. This gives you full independence between the iPhone and iPad. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to Fix Your Apps for more helpful tips.